Welcome to the Nintendo Wiretap for Tuesday, February 16th, 2021. On today's episode, we are talking about a brand new Nintendo Direct airing tomorrow, the first full-sized Nintendo Direct in over a year. So without further ado, let's take a look. It's, it's finally happening. A full-sized, authentic Nintendo Direct is airing tomorrow. That's right, tomorrow, February 17th at 2 p.m. Pacific, 4 p.m. Central Time, and boy, oh boy, is this a long time coming. Now, this might seem crazy to think, but the last time we had a full Nintendo Direct was in September of 2019. That's right, a year and a half ago was the last time we had a full-sized Nintendo Direct. And here it is, this one is, is massive. On average, a Nintendo Direct is 25, 35 minutes. This one is 50 minutes long. 50 entire minutes of Nintendo Direct goodness ready to go. Now here's what we know is going to be in it. The first thing we know is Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. They didn't specifically call out there'd be a new fighter, but they did say specifically that Super Smash Bros. Ultimate is being discussed tomorrow, but I would assume we're probably going to get our first look at the next DLC fighter, which really could be anything at this point. I have my fingers crossed for Crash Bandicoot, but if you want our full kind of rundown on what we're hoping to see tomorrow, you can tune into our live stream, which we're doing tonight, myself and Hero TJ. You can tune in right here on the Nintendo Wire YouTube channel. All right, next up, we know that specifically they're going to be touching on games that are coming out in the first half of 2021, which again, really could be anything. Now, my hope is we are one week away from the 35th anniversary of the Legend of Zelda series. So my hope is we're going to get something similar that we got with Super Mario's 35th anniversary. Maybe we'll get some sort of re-release. I think Twilight Princess and Wind Waker HD are about due for a re-release on the Nintendo Switch. There's the long-rumored Skyward Sword announcement that I'm really hoping we could get. And maybe... Just maybe we could see the 3DS ports of Majora's Mask and Ocarina of Time get a high definition treatment on the Nintendo Switch. I mean, those games were heavily reworked on the 3DS, so I could imagine that it wouldn't take a whole lot of time for them to rework those for the Nintendo Switch, but that's what I'm hoping from there. We have Metroid's anniversary coming up, the 40th anniversary of Donkey Kong. I mean, it's going to be, a, I think, a jam-packed session full of amazing Nintendo announcements. Obviously, the 25th anniversary of Pokemon is this year as well. I'm not sure if there's going to be a dedicated Pokemon Direct or if we're going to get some new Pokemon information in this live stream too. But again, this is 50 minutes. 50 full minutes of goodness. And it could be really anything at this point. So besides Smash Bros and the anniversaries coming up, your guess is as good as mine. Now, I think the other big question is, will Breath of the Wild 2 make an appearance during this? And again, that's going to be pure speculation too. They do call out games only coming in the first half of 2021. And my guess is that if that game does come out this year, it's going to be the second half. Maybe they'll touch on it. Maybe we'll get even more information. Maybe even just a name drop. Who knows? But again, with the 35th anniversary of The Legend of Zelda this year, Nintendo really could go all out with this one. But let me know your thoughts, your hopes, your dreams for this Nintendo Direct down in the comments below. And once again, if you want to see us geek out for like an hour, maybe an hour and a half tonight about what we hope to see during tomorrow's Nintendo Direct, tune in tonight at 8 o'clock Central Time right here on YouTube for our speculation stream with myself and Hero TJ. And until next time, guys, stay wired in. Bye. Wow.